subscribe and press the bell icon to get notified for the latest tech videos. Hey what's up YouTube this is Wasi here and today we are going to unbox the cheapest HDMI video capture card. So let's begin the unboxing video. So here is the HDMI capture card so I bought it from a store in China so it took around I would say 20 days to ship from China to Pakistan obviously the days varies but this was the cheapest one I could find and let's see if it is worth anything or not because if you want to go with the uh, expensive expensive one which are the Elgato capture cards then there are starting price is around 180 dollars or above and this is just for 15 dollars so this is really really cheap so here we have it HDMI video capture card on the right side we got it uh, I don't know some kind of sticker or something like that on the back we got introduction so the video capture card can capture both HDMI video and HDMI audio so it's capable of capturing video and audio that's good sending audio video signals to your computer smartphone preview stores etc supports input max resolution 4k so it can take an input of 4k but the output that will come to your pc or any other uh, laptop it will go for up to 1080p and not in uh, 4k so it is quite a cheap card so it's okay not that much bad supports 8 10 12 bit deep color we got uh, support AWG 26 HDMI etc etc and so on so you can read it if you want but I'm not going to read it all so nothing too much just a simple box let's see what's inside okay so we got this sliding and the box is empty from here here we got this user manual So you can read this whole user manual if you want it will show you how you can connect it so basically you can see it has a USB port on one side and an HDMI on the other side and you're going to need some kind of capturing software in order to do so you can use OBS software or Streamlabs I'm going to use Streamlabs in my case it again depends on personal preferences so here is the actual capture card itself so not too big very very small as you can see but uh, good quality i would say hdmi video capture card here is the output so you can see it has a usb 3.0 interface and here is the hdmi input place on the back we got made in china and not so much so basically this end will connect to the usb port of your laptop pc mac etc and the other end will have a hdmi port so you can uh, capture video recordings from your dslr camera if you're live streaming so one end will come from your DSLR camera and the other end will connect here or you can connect it with your smartphones as well. In my case, I'm going to use this HDMI capture card to capture gameplay of my iPhone. So I have bought a converter which will actually allow to connect HDMI cable to my iPhone and the other end of the cable will be connected here and this will be connected to my laptop. And in front of it, I will have some capturing software as I told you OBS or Streamlabs or any other software that is available. So that's all for the unboxing video. So let's check out how it actually performs. Is it any worth $15 or not? So now we're just simply going to connect our HDMI video capture card to one of the USB ports of our laptop. So you don't need any drivers. The windows will automatically pick it up. So here I have open broadcast software. Unfortunately, uh, Streamlabs wasn't working on my laptop for some reason. It was giving an error. Anyways, we can use this software as well. So in order to display the capturing device, it's very simple. All you need to go down to the sources. You need to press on the add icon or the plus button. You need to go to video capture device. You're going to press on OK. And by default, it should open your front camera of laptop if it has any. So from devices, we're going to click on USB video and it should display whatever the capture card is showing. So in my case, uh, I have connected the HDMI capture, capture card to my iPhone using the HDMI converter. But if you want to connect it to a camera so that you can live stream showing yourself, the process will be same. So here you can see that this capture card is working perfectly all right accord and by price i think it's really really good uh, you can also record audio from your device as well so currently it's going to record audio from this particular game from my iphone 
so i have tested it while playing this game for around half hour half hour and so so i didn't face any issue the card did not got very hot or anything like that everything ran smooth and guys one thing also it doesn't only depend on your capture card the hardware of your device which is running the software is also very important so in my case i don't have an nvidia graphic card so the output video when i screen recorded wasn't very good because my hardware wasn't that much good but i didn't got any complaint from this cheap hdmi video capture card so i will put uh, in the video description where you can buy this capture card if you're interested in it uh, i think it's really good for streamers who are just starting up and can't buy those 180 200 or 300 dollars elgato capture card for just 15 dollars i think it's just a good thing to buy for starters when you get a uh, big streamer you can go with the expensive ones there's no doubt in that because this one has the downside that it cannot uh give a stream of 4k it will only go up to 1080p so that's the downside of this card but other than that everything is okay according to me so guys that's the test of this uh, cheap hdmi video capture card hope this video was helpful to you so guys if you like this unboxing video please give this video a thumbs up if you have any kind of questions regarding this video write them in the comment section below and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so other than that thank you for watching and stay safe